Hey guys, what's up? Hey, I'm doing fantastic. Uh, Facebook Live in it, uh, YouTube in it, all of the different things. Check me out on Twitter at TuttleTutor, NeilHaley.com, Facebook, uh, Neil S. Haley, Total Celebrity Show, all these different things. Slow day today, so I'm ready to do uh, Facebook. My clients are calling me out because I've been having them go out and doing a video a day. That's not our topic today, but one of the things is always, always uh, stay on top of what you're doing. If you're not going out there and doing that, you're you're in big, big, big trouble and staying consistent in whatever you do social media wise, uh, consistency in your schedule, consistency in anything. But today, as we're going through the areas that you look at in the business, first is sales. That's the number one thing you need to look at every day in your business is your sales. After you look at sales and my teaching, it's marketing. But there's so many areas of marketing. Last time it was a website. I hope people have built a website. I hope people have called their web guy and said, hey man, I got to get a blog started. I need to get this started, that started. Well, I hope you were able to do that. Well, today we're going to talk about something that's the old school method in marketing. Especially if you're local. I'm not doing it as well. But anything that I'm teaching now, I need to implement. When I first started my tutoring business, I had business cards. And I was so excited to get these flashy business cards and talked about me as a tutor. And I'd hand it out to anyone I, when I was talking to them. The business card is still a powerful thing. Well, I'm fresh out of business cards, but the thing is I have clients all over the world. So a lot of times I'm not, you know, out there in the public eye. Well, that's going to change. So anything that I ask you guys to do, my fans and my followers, I will do as well. So the one thing I'm going to do is make sure that I get some business cards and flyers up and running ASAP with the new logo for the radio network, television network, just a business card that kind of says what I do today. So that's the first thing. Business people, entrepreneurs, pull out your business card, look at it and say to yourself, is this exactly telling people who I am? If it's not, it's time to update it. I think I have my old business, one of my old business cards. I thought I had it lying around somewhere in my car and, and, uh, <coughs> I'll have to post it to my page for my fans and maybe put it into part of this, but the importance of a business card is so important. You meet somebody in a networking event or you have that conversation over coffee or you're with a family or loved one and you say, do you have any cards for me? You better have cards. It works, trust me. And I don't implement it just because I've really been focusing on a national audience, international audience, but now with this local thing, starting with Valley Honda on Thursday, where I will be filming and taking photos and working with some of the local people in the area and getting out locally to different places. Like I met somebody last week at a Panera. Do you have a card? When you say you're fresh out, that's a good thing, but you better get their business card then. But that's an A number one marketing. Well, another thing is the flyer. Once you sit down and talk to a, a, a potential client and it's not a Skype, it's not a certain thing, either you want to have a PDF flyer to send to tell who you are, and I have a lot of those, trust me, or my website's a great business card or information card or uh, send a link. But when you're meeting with somebody physically, you, what you need to do is you need to go out there and uh, have a flyer. So when you're meet, sitting down with them and saying for lunch or breakfast and say, here's what I do and here are my bullet points. I provide this, 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 and this. So that they're taking notes on what you're providing, then they have that flyer. They put that in their car, they put it somewhere and they say, I gotta call the total tutor Neil Haley. I gotta call him. I got to take care of what I need to do and discuss that situation with him. So flyers, business cards. So really simple homework for tonight. Are your business cards telling you exactly what you do? If they're not, contact somebody like our good friends over at Word Association Publishing. They do great work 
with business cards and flyers and I'm going to tag that video to them to make sure I can uh, go ahead and plug how great they are. And so that word association, I'm gonna make definitely get my new business cards and flyers and any marketing materials from them. Two, uh, is my flyer telling me who I am, what I do, and is it gonna leave a lasting profession uh, uh, impression? Okay, make sure you like me on Facebook. Subscribe to my channel. Some fun things, I'm gonna have some viral videos coming, trust me people. Uh, we'll listen to my radio show, watch my television show, check out all those different and exciting things. And please, when I retweet as Total Tutor, all these amazing clients of mine, they're awesome. You say, wow, Neil, do you have any time for anybody else? I absolutely have maybe one or two spots available right now. They probably won't be available next week. So direct message me, inbox me, wherever you can, and I'd love to work with you. These videos were not going to be up for a long period of time as I'm using it as a run to write my first book. Then they will be on my website, which will have a membership site while creating the videos. So please, please, please check out that stuff. Jot down that information. Follow me at Total Tutor, at Total Radio Net. Like me on Facebook, Neil S. Haley. I mean, friend me, Neil S. Haley. Like me. Uh, Total Radio, I mean, like the uh, Total Celebrity Show and also like uh, the uh, Total Tutor Neil Haley. Share it, share it, share it. Follow me on Twitter, Instagram, all those different places. I, I forget, I lose track. Google Plus, add me in Google Plus and check me out. Real fun thing. Bubba from Bubba Gump's Shrimp, Forrest Gump's business partner, Bubba, will be on my show to talk about Fences Thursday. Check it out. It'll be out in social media. And I have somebody from the Outsiders WGN Network. Uh, some great, exciting guests. When I look at how blessed I am that I've gotten to interview people like Dan Marino. I've gotten to interview people like Mel Brooks. I've gotten to interview people like Art Rooney II. Nick Bonino when he won the Stanley Cup. To just amazing stories of... I, I'm just so blessed. And that is what it is to be an entrepreneur. To be able to do what you need to do and, and do it to the best of your ability. So take care, guys. I'll have another video tonight. See you later. I'm not going to be as good as my buddy, Sean Stasiak. Shout out to him, Dr. Sean. He is the video man. Content, content, content. Business cards, flyers. I'm out. Just kidding. Take care, guys. Talk soon.